The Triumph Hurdle trial is next. Does exactly what it says on the tin. It's a trial for the Triumph Hurdle. Two mile one furlong. Four year old juvenile hurdlers. Chaos Bell. Craig Beckwith. Final say. Darren Thompson. Mr. Fish. Martin Lidham. Potential in spades. Joshua Sutherland. Redondo Beach. Leon Van Rensburg. Cladora Alacaba. Derek Hinton. Pascalina Lansoff. Padraig Hogan. Ruth Noir's Fanning. David Robertson. Stiletto Heel. Daniel French. And White Tie Flower for Derek Hinton. Ten of them. And this then. All in and away. This is the exact same trip as the Triumph Hurdle, so it's a perfect trial. I'm surprised there's only 10 in it, considering it's the only four year old hurdle race of the week. Get to the first of the eight. Many people have realised that it's pretty pointless for your four year old hurdlers against the older horses because they're not going to beat them very often. But it's White Tide Flower and Cladora Alacava, the two Derek Hinton Greys, who are disputing the lead at the moment with Mr. Fish. In the purple and white stripes, now Stiletto here in the yellow and green is coming through as well. And what a few of these have won races this season. So this will be a proper trial. These will be some of the main contenders for the Triumph in about, what is it, five weeks' time, something like that. They get over the second. They're all safely over it with White Tie Flower in the lead from Stiletto here in second. Then Cladora Alacaba. He's in third with the final say in Chaos Belt. And with Dondo Beach, Pascal and Lance off. They're pretty tightly grouped up. Mr. Fisher was disputing the lead earlier, isn't there? Only two from the back. With those back two being potential in spades and Ruth Noir's fanning. Chaos Bell in the blue with the white sleeves is the one that's running widest on the track as they race towards the next. Which they all get over. Okay, one or two of them a little bit. Scruffy, but it's white tie flat. It's a race past the water jump and head towards the next flight. White tie flower from Redondo Beach, Chaos Bell. Mr. Fish has moved back up again by virtue of going the shortest way around. He's been trapped by Ruth Noir's fanning. Redondo Beach has moved considerably closer, so it's Chaos Bell, but it's white tie flower who's going to lead over the fifth. From Chaos Bell and Redondo Beach, Mr. Fish on the inside. Final say, Pascalina Lansoff and Stiletto Heel are next. Then Cladora Alacaba, Ruth Noir's fanning is after that one. And then finally the back marker is potential in spades as they head into the final mile. And they've only got three more flights of hurdles to take in this second half of the race. A white tie flower in the lead comes to the third last, skips over it nicely in front from Redondo Beach in second and Chaos Bell in third. Cladora Alacaba is next. Derek Hinson, the only one with two in. Then after that one, Stiletto Heel, who started the season off so well. On the outside, with on the inside, Mr. Fish, then Pascalina Lansoff, and final say, Ruth Noir's fanning, and finally, potential in spades as they head towards the final two. And White Tie Flower from Chaos Bell, Mr. Fish and Cladora Alacaba. Redondo Beach on the inside, Stiletto Hill on the outside. These six have pulled clear of the other four as they head down towards the second last flight. White Tie Flower comes to it in the lead, gets over it nice, he jumped it really well. Mr. Fish jumped it best of the rest in second. There's a long run out of the final flight. On the inside, Redondo Beach is now bursting through. Also on the outside, Ruth Noir's fanning come with a run and also final say starting to run on. This is wide open, it's White Tie Flower in the lead from Redondo Beach in second then comes Chaos Bell on the inside of Mr. Fish with Ruth Noir's fanning up the centre of the trap Cladera Alcaba Stiletto he haven't picked up yet final say is starting to run on the two furlongs to go and one flight to take and White Tie Flower and Redondo Beach are clear as they come down to this final flight then now is White Tie Flower trying to spring a bit of a surprise over it in the lead from Redondo Beach in second then comes Ruth Noir's fanning in third but it's White Tie Flower well inside the final furlong now being pressed again by Redondo Beach and Redondo Beach is beginning to get up and Redondo Beach is going to take it. Redondo Beach was the trial hurdle trial from White Tie Flower. Ruth Noir's fanning just getting up for second actually. Cladora Alacaba after that one. Chaos Bell, Mr. Fish all the way back to the disappointing pair Stiletto Hill uh, potential in spades but it's Redondo Beach who takes it for Leon Van Rensburg. Ruth Noir's fanning was second for David Robertson. Derek Hinton was third and fourth with White Tie Flower and Cladora Alacaba with Chaos Bell in fifth for Craig Beckwith.